On The View, one of daytime TV's stables since 1997, a diverse group of women discuss current events. This has led to many heated debates, resulting in some of the show's most controversial moments. From explosive on-air fights to unpredictable co-host exits, we take a closer look at The View's biggest controversies to date. In a surprising on-air announcement during season 10 of The View, Star Jones quit the show. Co-hosts, including the show's creator Barbara Walters, were shocked by the announcement, with Barbara saying she felt betrayed. And Coulter faced an uncomfortable moment while appearing on a show. Raven Simone questioned her about her divisive words, but Coulter was prepared and brought up a past comment Raven made about someone's name. Watch the exchange here. Whoopi Goldberg, known for her role in The View, previously defended Bill Cosby against sexual assault allegations, stressing the importance of the judicial process. However, she has now altered her stance on the issue. Kate Gosselin, of reality show John and Kate Plus 8, visited The View to discuss her custody battle. Whoopi Goldberg grilled the mother of eight after she violated the custody agreement and went to her ex-husband's house. Gosselin claimed a mother's intuition, but Goldberg questioned her risky move. Despite the tough interview, Gosselin returned to the show as a fill-in co-host and guest. The infamous Rosie O'Donnell and Elizabeth Hasselbeck debate on The View reached a boiling point in 2007. During a heated discussion on the Iraq War, the two hosts clashed and were put on split screen. Co-hosts Joy Behar and Sherry Shepard intervened, but the resulting confrontation became a legendary moment in TV history. Whoopi Goldberg defends Mel Gibson after voicemails to ex-partner Oksana Grigoryva go public. Goldberg said she was skeptical to label Mel a racist after spending time with him, sparking rebuttal amongst co-hosts. Joy Behar disagreed, saying, that language certainly sounds racist to me. Joan Rivers brought up Mel Gibson in an interview with Whoopi Goldberg. Despite controversy surrounding Gibson's past comments, Goldberg defended the actor. Rivers added a controversial remark about the Holocaust before ending the argument. In a past interview, Senator John McCain was put on the spot by co-hosts about his policies while running for president in 2008. Discussions ranged from his attack ads on Barack Obama to his vice presidential pick, Sarah Palin. Kelly Osborne faces backlash after making a comment regarding President Trump's immigration policy in 2015, stating, if you kick every Latino out of this country then who is going to clean your toilet? She apologized soon after, citing her words were a poor choice. Joy Behar, co-host of The View, received backlash after a Halloween photo resurfaced of her dressed up as an African woman with darker makeup. On the show, Raven Simone questioned if Joy was wearing tanning lotion. Joy explained she was dressed up for Halloween, but the show received criticism and she apologized publicly. Deborah Messing called for a list of donors at a pro-Trump rally in Beverly Hills and received disapproval from talk show hosts. Whoopi Goldberg compared it to the Hollywood blacklist and stated that people shouldn't be targeted for their political beliefs. Rosie O'Donnell's return to The View after seven years was not without some drama as she took a dig at former co-host Elizabeth Hasselbeck. During her interview, Rosie asked if Hasselbeck was present, reigniting their past feud. Republican presidential candidate, Carly Fiorina, was called on to The View but via webcam. She addressed the hosts about mocking her appearance in the past. Whoopi said it was a fake feud, but Carly later visited the show in person and faced tough questions. Cast members of a talk show paid tribute to the late former President Bush, but tensions arose when one host compared his policies to the current president's. Another host felt the focus should stay on Bush, not current politics. Controversy strikes The View as viewers petitioned to get Raven Simone fired for allegedly victim shaming. This came after Raven's comments on a viral video of a police officer using excessive force on a student for using her phone in class. The co-host suggested that the student shouldn't have been on her phone in the first place, causing mass backlash in a petition with over 130,000 signatures. 
In 2016, Whoopi Goldberg ended a show three minutes early due to skipping lines on a teleprompter. The live show caused confusion among the co-hosts and ABC executives. Watch to see the unexpected reaction. Whoopi Goldberg and Sherry Shepard's disagreement on gay marriage caused tension in season 12 of a show they appeared on. Sherry's Christian belief that marriage is between a man and a woman clashed with Whoopi's stance against government interference. The segment was deemed awkward. The View talks about Reverend Jesse Jackson using the N-word, with Elizabeth saying nobody should say it, while Sherry and Whoopi argue black people have changed its meaning. Elizabeth gets emotional and breaks down in tears. Barbara Walters defended Woody Allen against abuse allegations after his adoptive daughter accused him of sexually abusing her. Barbara, a longtime friend of Woody's, described him as sensitive, loving, and caring towards his daughters. However, her comments were met with backlash and criticism. Candace Cameron Bure stands up for a bakery that refused to bake a wedding cake for a lesbian couple, citing their First Amendment rights. This led to a disagreement with some of her co-hosts and an attempt to compare the discrimination to that of African Americans. Mocking a Miss America contestant praising her nursing profession landed two TV hosts in hot water. Nurses in America took to social media with the hashtag hashtag Nurses Unite to share their difficult jobs and slam the hosts. The backlash caused the show to lose sponsor Johnson & Johnson and apologize on the next episode with medical professionals as guests. Controversial remarks by guest Janine Pirro sparked a sudden end to her appearance on The View. Pirro accused co-host Whoopi Goldberg of having Trump derangement syndrome, causing Goldberg to abruptly end the segment by saying goodbye. Controversy arose during a racially charged segment on a talk show when one co-host made offensive remarks. Raven Simone stated, some people look like animals, when discussing a TV host's comments about Michelle Obama. Latino co-host Rosie Perez addressed prevalent racism within the Latin community, but Raven interjected with her remarks that have received criticism. Candace Cameron Bure, the conservative Christian host, has left the talk show after two seasons. She cited prior commitments to Hallmark and Netflix's Full House reboot as the reason for her departure. Breaking news, former co-host of The View, Nicole Wallace reveals she was never informed of her firing by the network. Fans were shocked by the announcement, but it seems that Nicole was just as surprised as viewers. In an interview with Variety, she expressed that she was never called by the network before the news broke. Stay tuned for more updates on this developing story. Bill O'Reilly sparked controversy on The View when discussing the Islamic Community Center near the World Trade Center. His argumentative tone made for an uncomfortable atmosphere, and when he declared, Muslims killed us on September 11th, Joy Behar and Whoopi Goldberg walked off stage. Donald Trump once claimed that Barack Obama was not a U.S. citizen, during an appearance on The View. Co-host Whoopi Goldberg vehemently disagreed with Trump's claims and called out his rhetoric as, BS. In 2010, Elizabeth Hasselbeck made comments about Aaron Andrews' attire during a discussion of her stalking case. Andrews responded by saying Hasselbeck's comments were a slap in the face to victims of stalking and sexual predators. Meghan McCain speaks out in defense of her late father, Senator John McCain, against President Trump's attacks at campaign rallies. The emotional and powerful speech was delivered on The View and has gained widespread attention. In a heated discussion about politics, Meghan McCain called out co-host Joy Behar for repeatedly interrupting her. As the only conservative voice, Meghan found it hard to express her opinions and even criticized Lindsey Graham's support of Trump. The argument escalated as Joy kept chiming in, causing Meghan to bluntly remind her that the 2020 election is not a sure win. Jedediah Bila suddenly left her co-hosting role on a popular show in 2017, just two days into the season. Despite having signed a contract, she must have been bought out by ABC. Joy Behar has hinted that she and co-host Meghan McCain don't get along backstage. While on air, 
guest host Elizabeth commented on the fights between Joy and her, to which Megan offered a comparison between herself and Elizabeth. Joy then responded that they never fought behind the scenes, leaving the audience and co-hosts surprised. Whoopi Goldberg and Rosie O'Donnell had a heated exchange about racism on a talk show. Whoopi claimed her co-hosts didn't know what real racism was, but Rosie disagreed, stating you don't have to be black to understand racism. Meghan McCain from The View got into a heated argument with Sonny Hostin while discussing the topic of abortion. Fans called it a tantrum as Meghan repeatedly talked over Sonny, who remained calm while delivering her points on the issue. And Coulter's five appearances on The View over the years have been marked by controversy, with the far-right pundit often sparking outrage with her comments. In one particular instance, Coulter claimed that the O.J. Simpson verdict was actually the best thing that ever happened for African Americans in the U.S. Meghan McCain stirs things up on The View as the co-hosts discuss the college bribery scandal. The conversation gets personal when Meghan defends her family's legacy and military service, leading to a debate with Joy. They eventually move on to other topics. Whoopi Goldberg caused a buzz when she begged for a commercial break during a heated discussion over the Mueller investigation, which turned into a left versus right disagreement. This happened on the talk show, The View, when Meghan, Sonny, and Joy couldn't see eye to eye on the matter. Whoopi remained calm and looked directly at the camera while requesting the break. Whoopi Goldberg is under fire for cutting off political commentator Meghan McCain on their talk show. McCain was discussing her difficulty with liberals as a conservative when Goldberg interrupted her. Viewers are speaking out about it. Whoopi Goldberg surprised her co-hosts by returning to The View after falling ill with pneumonia and sepsis. Sharing her experience, she warned viewers of the dangers of sepsis and the speed at which health can deteriorate. Barbara Walters, the co-founder and former co-host of the hit TV show The View, retired in 2014. She played a crucial role in making the show a massive success. Walters garnered worldwide recognition for her work as a journalist.